That was sick. I like skateboarding because of the stoke. I just like skateboarding and snowboarding, both of them. I just, I love like transition and like, you know, finding perfect little tricks or things that just make you feel so good when you do it. I love this shit. Oh yeah. So running into yeah, things really or going good. over things or whatever. Yeah. Just like the whole stoke of it. Fuck yeah! I had already been snowboarding for several years and uh, I had just sort of developed this hatred for summertime because I couldn't snowboard. And so I just was like, damn, I need something that's like snowboarding so I can think that way and be stoked on that sort of thing like all year long. And, and uh, skateboarding was like the absolute obvious choice. 2019. Oh. I Tom earlier, I like the tennis. The front double court, I do a 180. I'm like, <laughs> I want to start doing like shit things. When you all eat? Yeah. Have you ever tried that? Shifty yeah, I've tried it before. Can you front side shifty on a snow skateboard? I've been trying. Like all the back side. And then I met Fred here, and uh, we met snowboarding, and then became good friends over that one winter. And then when summer came around, I realized that he skated like every single day. So um, I was like, wow, if I'm gonna hang out with this guy, I gotta probably learn to skateboard. It's just playing around. Uh, 180 to shove it to I'll do that. I'll do what he said. Not because he said it though, because I wanted to do it. <laughs> Because I set like really high standards for myself with skateboarding and snowboarding in particular. So whenever I whenever a challenge comes, I like to say I enjoy it, but sometimes I get a little too serious. Oh! I like the achievement better. Yeah, because a lot of times I'll spend way too much time on it. And then even when I land it, I won't even be happy. I'll just be like finished, you know, and beat up. <laughs> but um, yeah, the only, I don't really like whenever I get stuck in that kind of mind frame. It's like okay, I just gotta do this. <laughs> it's kind of that's kind of something I like work on with skateboarding because that's like a weakness of mine. Is whenever I get like in a certain like whenever I get the blinders on, it's like <coughs> I'll tear myself up inside and out just to land a trick. So it's like I have to really watch myself. So like the whole process of it, it gets I get carried away really easy. So. <laughs>
Um, I like that, uh, like before I skateboarded, um, like cities and towns, sidewalks, parking lots, that was all like really kind of boring and super mundane. And now I look at it and it's pretty much like looking at a ski resort. Like you're looking around for all sorts of little things to jump over or grind or whatever, little, you know, just you look at it in a super creative way. The same as you would look at a, just a run on the mountain if you're snowboarding. Absolutely, it's like a concrete ski resort. It's awesome.